I'm Janine from Holland and you're watching the expedition. I am Jaola. <laughs> I'm Talitha. I'm Denise. You're, you're watching, watching the, the expedition. expedition. The expedition. Fascinating stories of this small and coast. Neatly tucked on the northerly end of the southern coast, Tujeren cannot be missed in its location on the edge of this main highway, outlining the expansive stretch that forms the south. The town is steadily growing and becoming a major attraction, from a small coastal community to a housing boom drawing massive estate investments and first-class resorts that pride on local tradition and culture. Visitors to Tujereng have a long list of local delights to consider, but this expansive coastline is a must-see offering a real magical moment to pause and appreciate the beauty and natural scenery of the South. Here, one understands the real meaning of a true getaway, escaping the never-ending hustle and bustle of the city with an almost empty beach, stretch of clean white sand begging to be explored while the waves thumb the shore all day long. You might even catch a fishing boat and fisher folk, either anchoring or ready to discover the inviting Atlantic. This is one place just perfect to begin your exploration of Tujereng and that is why we are heading to what is said to be the main highlight of our tour of this exciting settlement. I know we've seen a lot of places, heard of a lot of places here in this country but today we are about to show you a place that a lot of people do not know about here in Tujereng. This is Expedition Gambia, my name is Fateli Kamuloshi and today we are discovering the secret gardens in here at Tujereng. I'm sure you want to come in and see how fabulous this place is and all the services they have for you that are watching. I'm about to take a tour and you might as well want to come along with me. So come, let's have the ride. The Secret Garden is a resplendent picture postcard resort which lures visitors with its natural scenery and dainty looking houses, enticing you for a night and longer stay in the resort's lush and colorful backdrops. Built and designed by Gambian entrepreneur Musa Bajaha, the Secret Garden offers a unique home experience, blending a mixture of southern hospitality with a deep love for spicy and continental cuisine. With his sights set on carving a solid niche in the booming hospitality industry, Bajaha is an example of the growing set of young investors looking to redefine tourism in the Gambia. His holiday model takes after a unique local approach that is witnessing quite a trendy rage in the country with many vacationers choosing to stay in eco resorts that generally begin as small startups in small communities like Tuja Rang. Well, we are here having a cool time at the Secret Gardens and I have with me the founder and uh, manager of this hotel and I want you, him to actually introduce himself and tell us who he is on the program. Welcome to Expedition. Welcome. Hi, I'm Mohamed Bajaha. Um, I'm, I live in Banjul. Well, this place, I was, I just like doing ecotourism. So, 1996 about this place you know so i feel like he's in the middle of the nature site and 
you know, I just have this aim long time ago. I'm just want to live in the, you know, in the community and do ecotourism. So that's my dream and I, you know, trying to do it. You know, the sky is the limit, you know, you can do a lot of things here, you know. For a beautiful getaway, the Secret Garden Hotel is the perfect spot to be with studio bedrooms and plush accommodation for a romantic break, master bedrooms and other assortments. The spot will leave you with delightful memories to sever for a long time. One can easily spend a whole year here and not get bored. The rooms are very well ventilated with clean bathrooms and attractive settings containing beautiful paintings that bring one's imagination to life. The facilities here are amazing, from the swimming pool, basketball lawn and expansive environment that invites any activity of your choice. It's the new outlook of the tourism industry and officials are certainly behind the idea which engages efforts to equally preserve and sustain the beauty of natural environment. Going green in the southern coast, that's certainly a strong aura in the south, which unfailingly appears in Stujereng's secret garden. And as I sit here enjoying the lovely breeze, I couldn't help but fall in love with the hospitable spirit of the south. Still discovering the secret garden, we are here at the bar. This is why you get to reserve everything you want from drinks, water, everything you want to drink is served here at the bar. I'm having a cool time here with my crew. You might as well want to try it sometime with your loved ones, your family and friends. Remember, the place is very secret as the name implies. It's all the way down here, away from the road. In case you want to come by, it's definitely a cool place that you want to explore and I'm sure you have a pretty time. Have you seen? We've seen a lot of places in here that you can come and and you know, have time with your loved ones uh, for a couple of days, months, weeks, as long as you want to stay in here. We have the sports area, you've seen the beautiful and nice pool rooms that we have, the jacuzzi inside the bedroom. Everything is in here as long as you are ready to come and adventure at the Secret Gardens here at Tujering. I've been Fatelika Muloshi and this was all we had for you in this episode of the expedition. So I come your way next week, have a wonderful week. A day in Tujering. Exploring the fascinating self is like no other, with pleasant trappings and delights ringing entirely of the attractive aura of the smiling coast.
watching the expedition. I am Jaola. I am Talitha. I am Denise. You're, You're watching, watching the, the expedition. expedition. The expedition. Fascinating stories of this smiling coast.